So tell me about this one. I mean, it really is becoming a specialty of yours to uh, qualify last and then come in and uncork something and get you out of the podium. Well, I mean, if you go in an eighth place, you have nothing to lose, so you just do what you can do, and uh, I, it doesn't give you time to get nervous or anything, and just I did a, real, a good routine for me, so I was really happy. Now the routine that you did use, could you just describe that one a little bit? Was that the higher difficulty one that was around 15 at one time? Um, it was. Uh, it's a 14.8 that I did. Um, it's 0.2 above. Well, 0.2 above what I was supposed to do in the preliminaries. Um, but I just added one of the tricks from my first routine into my second routine to give it a little bit extra. And how did you find the nerves today going in there? Uh, as the last qualifier, and you told me the other day you thought you really had you're going to try to take the approach of nothing to lose and just go for it. Yeah, um, I guess at times today I was a bit nervous, but when it really came down to it, I was really excited to be in the final. Uh, so I just kind of fed off that, and I had a really good warm up. So nerves weren't too much of a factor. I was just really excited and really eager to show them that uh, that I could do a really solid routine. Uh, now this is the second time you won a world medal. The same, uh, the same bronze medal that you won in uh, month in Quebec City. How does it feel this time? Uh, feels pretty good. Uh, you can never feel bad when you get a medal. So. I'm pretty excited. And uh, you also talked a bit the other day about not having Karen with you on this trip. So, uh, how did it also feel knowing that without Karen in the lineup, Canada can still come through and come away with a medal in women's trampoline? Um, I think that's uh, it shows that we have a lot of depth in our sport. And I mean, even beyond the two of us, we have some really strong younger athletes coming up. And I think it's going to show really well for the team event next Worlds. Now, uh, this is a sport where you're always learning. Every meet, every meet you go to, there's something new to be learned. What will you take away from this one? Uh, don't take anything for granted. I mean, uh, just do your routines the best you can and hopefully it works out. But I think you just have to focus on what you're doing and not focus on the other athletes and really just keep at it. One final question. So when you look at the athlete you were two years ago when you won the bronze in Quebec City and the athlete you are today, what would be, if you were going to put your finger on maybe one thing that's changed quite significantly, what would it be? Um, Maybe a bit more confidence now. I mean, I have two more years experience, uh, a couple more World uh, Cup final experience and things like that. So probably that's a major thing.